Hey guys, what's up? Linus here. As you all know, I am leaving on... Well, as, as you all know, I do say that, but I'm not entirely sure that you all do. Um, but I'm leaving on a trip very soon, and some people have been asking me to give some more details as to what is going to be happening and where I'm going to be going and that sort of stuff. So I figured I'd just make a separate video so that people who don't care don't have to listen to me talk about this uh, for a little bit. Um, now this is just for the people that want to know what's going on, on my trip. There's no important update. There's nothing important about this video or entertaining. It just it's just merely some information as to uh, what I'm gonna be doing. So like I told you some of you guys before, I'm pretty sure I did tell some of you guys is that I am um, leaving on a trip. I am leaving the 31st of May. So that's in three days for me at the time I'm recording this. I'm leaving in in the, the early morning. Like 8 a.m. I'm leaving from where I live. I would rather not give details as to where exactly that is, but I'm leaving from there. And I'll be traveling to Paris first. We're going to Paris. Um, also, what I forgot to say is that we're going on an interrail trip. If you're not quite sure what interrail is, I will put the official website in the description. Uh, it's basically just a ticket you buy. Um, and it comes in a couple of different variants you can pick one for like a week one for two weeks and four weeks or something like that and basically you buy one ticket it's like a few hundred euros um, and then you can just travel pretty much infinitely throughout Europe and it's it's um, everywhere in Europe so it's northern Europe whether you're going to Scandinavia or whether you want to go to Italy or Spain or Portugal, or the Netherlands, which is where I live, or Germany, or even like the Eastern Europe, where I have never in my life been before. Uh, you can go there as well. Just all through Europe, there's like 50 countries, I believe. Wait, 50? That doesn't sound right. Just there's a, a whole bunch of countries that you can go to. Um, and basically, that's what I'm going to be doing with four of my friends. Um, we are going on one of those trips for two weeks. We're leaving the 30th. Uh, 31st, I mean, we were leaving the 30th, blah, 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 30th, and now we're leaving the 31st uh, in the early morning, and we will be coming back on the 13th, because the 14th, I will be hearing about my exams, which I made earlier this, these past couple of weeks, three weeks actually, I uh, made a bunch of exams, and I'll be hearing whether or not I actually passed uh, this year, and whether or not I will be graduating. So that's all really, you know, exciting and interesting and stuff. Um, so obviously we're all looking forward to the trip. It's going to be a lot of fun. Um, and also, um, I'm also looking forward to hearing whether or not I will actually graduate. Because my school time has been a nightmare for both me and my parents. Um, I never really did anything for school too much. Um, I was just too busy with other things. And right now, I feel kind of bad about that. Uh, but after I graduate, I'm pretty sure I will feel good about it again. Um, I just hope that I do graduate. Because otherwise, I am just pretty dumb. Um, so anyway, I should not focus on the graduation. I need to forget about that. Um, so where I'm at right now is it's the 28th. So I've got two more exams. I've got philosophy and economics. And then the day after economics... We are already leaving from the Netherlands to Paris. Now, at first we had this whole planning from, you know, we, where we wanted to go and whatnot. And after a bit of discussion within the group, we decided to just have sort of a general outline and not really, you know, have it all like set in stone where we're going, if that's even the right usage, uh, the usage of that expression. So basically we're going to Paris. We'll sleep in Paris for the first day. And there's a few things where we'd like to go. Um, just a few of the places we're going to be visiting are Madrid, Barcelona. I'm just saying, I'm hoping I'm saying this right in English because I we actually have it all written down in Dutch. Milan, 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 that sounds right. Venice, I don't know how to pronounce this in either language. It's the capital city of Slovenia, Ljubljana. It's weird, I cannot pronounce it, I swear to God. We're going to Vienna, and last we're going to Berlin. So that's about eight cities we'll be visiting, and we have about two weeks. So it's going to be a pretty tight schedule, but hopefully it's going to be lots of fun. Uh, where's lots of freedom for all of us, and I mean, it's just, you know, the five of us, just a bunch of friends from school, and it's going to be awesome. So that is basically the general plan right now. Like I said, it's not set in stone, so I'm not entirely sure what will be uh, going on. And um, 
yeah, that's just a, that's a trip I'll be going on. So that's gonna be a lot of fun. And after that, I'm like I said, I'm coming back the 13th, 14th. I'll be hearing whether or not I graduated, and then the 28th. There are uh, there's an opportunity for some people to retake exams. So whether or not you are you know happy with a certain grade, you can retake one exam. So if you screw up majorly, you're screwed either way. But some people are like right on the edge, and if sometimes they have like one exam uh, exam that they ruined, and then they can just retake it and just try again and graduate either way. Um, hopefully, I don't have to do that because. I don't give a shit about my grades. As long as I graduate, then I'm fine with anything ever. Um, that is seriously the only thing I care about. So hopefully the 14th, I'll actually hear that I'm graduating, that I will not be you know, going to retake an exam because then I have another two weeks of freedom uh, in front of me in which some other people are going to be studying again. So that's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, but then I can finally, you know, get myself to record a lot more. And it's just two free weeks. That is amazing. I haven't had that in so long. I'm going to live stream a whole lot. I just spoke to Ray, King's Entourage, and we're probably going to be doing a charity live stream sometime in the future. And that's going to be a lot of fun as well. Uh, but we're, we're not entirely sure as to when that's going to happen, but I will be sure to let you guys know. Um, but I'm also going to be streaming a lot more since I have a lot more free time, and I like free time. And also, I was thinking about doing some live streams, um, maybe for charity, maybe just... For fun, I'm not quite sure, but just live streams where I try to complete like a full game it, it, within that live stream. So maybe it'll be a live stream that's like 24 hours long, and I try to complete like a Fire Emblem game or or Bioshock or Silent Hill. I'm not sure. There's loads of games that I could do, uh, but if that sounds good to you guys, then be sure to let me know because I am actually really looking forward to doing somewhat longer live streams and. Just playing more video games in general, because I have been super busy with exams. I mean, I have not done shit in the past couple of years. So I really had to catch up for the exams. And it, this is what, this was like the real deal, you know, your finals. So I just had to put myself behind my books and study. And up to this point, everything went pretty well. My exams, for you know, f from what I feel like, it, it went pretty well. So hopefully... I I can tell you guys that I will I am graduating, um, and I'll be sure to upload a video about that. Or if I'm not graduating, I'll make sure to cry myself to sleep that night or even afternoon. I'll just cry all afternoon and, and through the night. It's gonna be terrible. Um, but uh, I mean that day is gonna be terrible. I don't know if, what it what it works like in your country. Basically, here your school is gonna call you from like 12 a.m. onward. Or is that p.m.? I don't even know. I think 12 a.m. No way, that's 12 p.m., isn't it? Like in the afternoon, they basically have this whole meeting, like your school staff. And then after that, they actually call the students and they're like, oh, so you are graduating or you're not. So everybody is going to be tripping balls the whole day, just sitting behind their desk or whatever you're doing. Just sitting there staring at your phone and you know that someone's going to call you and say, oh, hey, you're graduating because there's like only 5% max of all people are not graduating. It's like my school has got like the weirdest or the best number, I suppose, in, in at least one of the best numbers in the whole country. So there's like this pretty slim chance that you are not graduating. You're like one of those people that are going to be left behind. And then everybody will be posting on Facebook and Twitter all day. Oh, I graduated. I graduated. And then just a few people are going to be left out. You know, that's going to suck for them. Hopefully, I'm not one of those. But um, I'll be sure to let you guys know what's going on with that. And this, this video is way too long. Uh, but I just wanted to make you just a short video to, to let you all know what's going on. With my trip and my exams, I suppose as well, which I didn't even mean to talk about. But this is going to be fun. Um, this trip, I'm really looking forward to it. And like I said, I have like a whole bunch of videos ready to... Well, they're not ready to upload. They're already uploaded and they will be releasing every day. So basically, I'm not even here and my channel is running itself. That's, that's robots for you. So um, anyway, thanks for just listening to me bullshit for... For so long, almost 10 minutes, you guys are crazy. And uh, just thanks for your continued support. And I will talk to you guys as soon as I get back.